Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And somebody asked me a question about the privacy settings in the uh, speech recognition in Windows 11. And he said that a friend of his told him that um, there could be some privacy issues with the online speech recognition feature. He relies on the speech recognition in Windows and says, well, I don't want to turn off speech recognition, but I'm just curious as to why a, um, my friend is actually telling me about privacy. So Windows 11 has two ways of doing its speech recognition. And it can do it on its own in your PC. And that's what pretty much Windows would do, like starting with about Windows XP, I believe, when the speech recognition started. And later on, Windows 7 and so on, it was a local speech recognition. There was a way that Windows could understand what you were saying. It was not as accurate as uh, today for the reason that today we do have an online speech recognition turned on. So the privacy concern of your friend is the fact that some of your um, voice clips will be sent to Microsoft servers, and that is to improve the speech recognition capabilities. So if you go into your settings in Windows 11, privacy and security, and you go into speech, you will see that it's on by default. And so um, the online speech recognition in this case means if you use speech recognition, it's going to send some clips of your voice from time to time to improve the recognition. And it does improve, it does make it better, but that's where probably the privacy issue is for your friend. The fact that you know you rely on having your voice being sent regularly to Microsoft servers. So what you could do is turn off the speech recognition, uh, online speech recognition. This doesn't prevent, once again, the speech recognition from working but it will do it locally. It might be less accurate, but no clips of your personal voice will be sent out to Microsoft servers once this switch is off. So it's up to you to um, see if it's a problem or not. Also, it does say here, when you turn it off, some Microsoft apps might actually require to have the online speech recognition working so that they can actually work. So it depends on the app also where you might turn it on or off. What you could do is if you use speech recognition regularly and one of the apps tells you, oh, well, you know, it has to be turned on for online speech recognition, you turn it on while you're using the app and you can turn it off after and use the regular speech recognition from within your uh, Windows operating system. So it's all up to you to decide if you want or not that feature to work, and like I said, it's the fact that it's sending some uh, clips of your voice to Microsoft servers. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.